Update. Since about 2005 foreign branded automakers have switched to timing chains instead of timing belts. Although it is good news, they are mostly still using interference engines. Hence, the same problem still exists, major engine damage if the timing chain, however unlikely, should break. Timing chains should never need changing and should outlast the rest of the vehicle. Do you have a high-maintenance automobile? Depending on the model and manufacturer, you may have purchased either a new or used car that will end up costing you more than you realize and give you a headache. What is striking in examining what autos are high maintenance is that most of the autos in question are imported. Specifically, engines designed a certain way to maximize power and conform to strict pollution control standards are interference engines. These engines are labeled interference engines because the pistons have the potential to have their power stroke interfered with by a valve if the timing belt breaks or a new belt has not been installed correctly. As you can guess, interference in an engine design can be a bad thing if the manufacturer's recommended maintenance is not followed. Damage can result if the timing belt breaks or installation of a new belt is not done correctly, resulting in one or more pistons striking a valve causing a broken valve and other internal engine damage, resulting in huge repair bills for the unlucky owner. Interference engines have not been the norm throughout the automobile industry, as they have mostly been confined to imported automobiles, whether they are cars, trucks, or SUVs. Domestic manufacturers have been aware of the problems and repair bills that can result when using interference engines in their autos and have mostly not used them. Domestic manufacturers have mostly used engines with timing chains made out of high-strength steel which most of the time do not break and do not need to be replaced and do not require high levels of maintenance. However, even if an auto needs a timing belt, it does not necessarily mean the motor is designed as an interference motor and the auto owner can try and cheat the maintenance schedule to a degree and not worry about breaking a timing belt. A broken timing belt in a non-interference motor simply means the driver would suffer a powertrain loss and their auto would slow to a halt along the road or the auto will not start. Replacing the timing belt would cost probably about $700 depending on your car and the work involved. Damage from broken timing belt in an interference motor can result in major engine repair work or replacement starting about $2,000 or more. Consumers worried about expensive repair bills should be greatly concerned and should do their own research when they are in the market for a new or used car. A rule of thumb would be to avoid imported cars, as most do use interference motors and stick with autos from the big three traditional auto manufacturers in the United States. However, one domestic manufacturer, the smaller of the three, is noted for using interference engines and careful research should be done if you wish to avoid buying an auto with an interference engine. All professional mechanics should know what an interference engine is, although auto salesmen may or may not know the difference. Gates Company, a well-known maker of engine belts, has a handy online directory of vehicles using interference engines.